In this video, we will be taking up another type of function which is called as many one function. We have already covered one one function and we are on the second number of the list covering many one function in this video. Let us see what do we basically mean by many one function by taking up its definition and then a graphical analysis too along with arrow diagram. Let's see. Many one function. If two or more different elements of A, if two or more different elements have the same image. That means if there are two sets A and B and the elements of A and elements of B are enlisted, considering that different elements of A have the same image in B, then it is a many one function. It can also be mathematically written as if x1 not equal to x2 still fx1 is equal to fx2 then it is a many one function. I mean to say that if x1 and x2 are two different elements of a set and they aren't equal still their f images still their images are equal we obtain a many one function. Let's see a graphical study of the same and then with the help of an example of graph again we would be drawing an arrow diagram and studying it. An example of many one function would be a graph like this. This is an upward parabola and for checking whether a graph is one one or many one what do we have to do? We have to draw a line parallel to the x axis. Now if this line parallel to the x axis cuts or intersects the graph at more than one point it is called as a many one function. You can see here there are two intersecting points so this is a many one function. Whereas in this example that I am drawing over here again a graph is there x axis y axis here also x and y axis if the graph is somewhat like this. Now the curve is strictly increasing curve to check whether it is many one or not you can draw a line parallel to the x axis it cuts or intersects the graph at only one point. Since it cuts the graph at only one point, so it is not many one. Rather, this is an example of a one one function which we did earlier. So these two examples tell us that which kind of graphs would be many one and which kind of graphs would not be many one. After having the detailed study about the graphs, as to which would be many one and which would not, let's see some arrow diagram for the same. If I have two arrow diagrams with two sets as A and B and the function is written as a mapping from A to B, there are different elements say in A and again there are different elements in B. Now if the mapping is described such as I have 1 associated with A, 2 also associated with A, 3 associated with C and 4 associated with D. The mapping is shown such that 1 and 2 have the same image that is A. That means as per the definition of many one function mathematical statement that we had seen here the two non different the two non same elements that means the two different elements had the same image same is the case here one and two are different but the image they have is same so this is an example of a many one function hence in this video, we basically saw what do we mean by a many one function 
and we also saw some graphical analysis and arrow diagram or mapping diagram for the same.